As the Mellowan's mind pierces yours, the tadpole pulses with power. It feels ten times its size. Alive. Awake. Almost smug. This is most unusual. The incubation period should be complete, as should your transformation. But the lava is infused with strange magic. It appears to be in some form of stasis. I can only theorize, but I suspect your transformation would be both agonizing and instantaneous. I thought it was always agonizing, Amelium. Well, yes. But that wasn't my point. No. It appears to be shielded from physical and magical influence. Moreover, the cranium has undergone severe trauma. It is a miracle the brain functions at all. Extraction would risk much. The lava is not the only creature that has been inside this brain, but at present it is the sole resident. It seems as if someone did not want you to. Unfortunately, beyond the assessment of my own kind, I cannot speculate what has passed through your cerebrum. But not to worry. Should you transform, I will happily perform a new examination. A nautiloid? Fascinating. I have never set foot on one myself. They were our warships during the greatest eras of the Illithid Empire. We ruled the entire astral plane from their decks. The design was lost when the Gith rebelled and ended our dominion. Of course, I am sorry I cannot assist you in its removal. But I have an idea. Oh, perhaps I should start taking notes. There may be a way to bypass that stasis. There are many alchemical substances that can influence the mind. A tincture distilled from a collection of rare mushrooms. They have subtle psionic influence. I would require a fresh tongue of madness and Timusk spores. But be warned, in their natural state, both of these mushrooms can be quite dangerous. Timusks cause confusion in those that approach them. The tongue is self-explanatory. The Underdark, of course, although they are quite rare, and their discovery perilous. Hmm. I imagine Lenore would have them in her possession. She served Mistra as a cleric. She is quite fond of her garden. Lenore has always been a lonely sort. Nature was her only companion. I offered her the chance to join the society, but she refused. Her experiments on Sousa Bark took priority. May your travels be safe and swift. I greet you, child of the sun. How has your search for the mushrooms fared? I was born with a propensity for arcane magic my people despise. It gave me the strength to resist the elder brain. 
Every waking hour I pushed back against its dire hold. My wizardry empowered me. The moment its control shattered, I fled before the colony discovered I had defected. In the beginning, I had an arrangement with a lich. Excellent company, despite what one would expect. I required brains, he required souls. A perfect symbiosis. But our ambitions eventually splintered. I wished to better the world, and he preferred its rot. So I left his company. And thus, I now feed from those who act against the society's goals. Perhaps the peoples of the Underdark will be less inclined to violence if they comprehend the cost, yes? How is your more... Personal risk. Welcome back. Have you made any new discoveries? I do enjoy a good bargain. If anything in my private collection is to your liking. Very well. Welcome back. Have you made... I do enjoy a good bargain. If anything in my private collection is to your liking. Very well. Have you spoken with Scris lately? is familiar. Poison, derived from a wild weed common to the Underdark. She'll need an antidote soon, most likely held by the Poisoner. Helping me. I thank you for your help, but I gotta get moving. Oh, it hurts. Carl's garters. Oh, I don't have time for this. My kin need me. Seems you're the helping kind. All right. I need you to rescue my kin. Not charity, mind. We can pay. We're Iron Hand Clan. Best artificers in Baldur's Gate. We were on an expedition down here when the Dwergar snatched us up. I got away, but not the others. The Greys have them digging out some old ruin across the lake. Some dusty temple. It doesn't matter. They'll work my clan to death before they ever get near it. Just mining for materials. No, nothing unusual. But our work pays well. Help my clan and we'll make it worth your while, I swear. Thank you. Only wish I could go with you. But here... 
I nabbed these boots from the Greys when I ran. I'll feel better knowing you're using them to kick some Dwegger ass. I'll mark where I made my escape and uh, wait here, I suppose. Not much choice, eh? What is the creature doing? The sovereign's thick fingers stroke the corpse at its feet. A droning melody greets you as the creature turns its gaze to you. Flesh talker, I show you a memory. Watch and listen. A violent vision grips you. Dwega, dark dwarves chopping myconid remains. They broke our peace. They killed our young. The Sovereign's song slows to the pace of a dirge. It is still in mourning. We laid waste to many, but intruders remain. Lakewood. The Sovereign's song halts as it measures your worth. I sense your resolve. You will find Dwergar invaders near Lake's Edge. Cleanse the rot. Destroy them. Dwegar invaders? We can manage that. Better than picking this fight, surely. Deep purples swirl into familiar shapes. Gnomes in mining gear, chased by Dwega. The Dwega seek a gnome. It is a guest. The Sovereign says nothing, but you hear appreciation in its song. into our enemy's flesh. The dead make a fine host for my growing children. If I die down here, destroy my corpse. You may not. The spores hear only the circle. They dance to no other harmony. The Sovereign gifts you one more vision. A wall of vines parting to reveal glowing light. Riches of magic and mind. Cleanse the rot, and they are yours. You do the Circle a service. We will await word. It 
cringes in response to your sunny vision. It reveals its own home in reply, a humid cove filled with decaying myconid corpses. Dwega destroyed my people. I am a sovereign with no circle. This circle does not welcome me, but I have heard the song. You mean to cleanse the Dwergar rot. I mean to join you. In death, your foe becomes your ally. I will raise it. You may command it. I am the danger, and I am the cure. They erased my people. I will erase theirs. Remain in the Underdark, and I will follow. We cleanse the rot together. Come to the circle. Seems the shrooms are letting in more people every day. You see a fella on his own on your way in. Dwarf. Balin's his name. Right. Never mind. Knock yourself out, but don't come begging for coin if you find him. You try to ransom him to me, you'll find yourself skint and stuck with a fat old lout. My useless husband. Sent him for an errand. It's no surprise he's made a mess of it. the hole you see only darkness it's impossible to tell how deep it goes by sight alone your call echoes as it plunges downward before gradually fading away quiet oh your mate will fill my 
my belly. You disturb me still. Enough. Away from here. Still These fresh. things drain away one's Something magic. Something with massive claws made here. this. and meat. Work my magic. Very true,
Well? Right now. Waiting for my idiot husband's return. Lest you've seen him, we don't have much to head. Worthless old fool. He had one bleeding job. Love? <laughs> Never heard of it. Balin was a rotten old bastard. Treated me like an old shoe for 70 years before his mind started to go. Softened him up. Made him realize how much he needed me. Losing his mind was the only good he ever did by me. Collecting noble stock. Valuable mushroom. We have a shop in Boulder's Gate. The locals go mad for it. Not no more, though. Ah. To no surprise of mine, you're more competent than Balin. Go on, then. Hand it over. Loads. But I haven't got anything to offer for it. And I'm counting on the shroom for that. Give it or don't. We... I run a shop called Bone Cloaks in Baldur's Gate. Balin nearly sunk the shop to pay for a drink. When he was of his own mind. If I can put noble stock on the shelves, it might allow me to hang on a little longer. I thank you. Truly, I do. Come visit me in Baldur's Gate if you find yourself that way. Might be I can repay your kindness. You take care out here. I've got to die down. Corpses. These creatures did battle with Dwergar. abandoned.
names of settlements are crossed out. Breachstone, Sinkhole, Salson, Lolf, Old Kell, Demons. such an accelerated rate. It is... Stopped me yet. What's the story?
punch. A headache. Swift as my feet can carry me.
Wolves are watching me.
way to the nearest light. Got a long road ahead. The mark of the center. Bound to be more to this place than meets the eye. Step is the hardest. Yeah.
What's that? Broken bones. Must have fallen. <laughs> <laughs> 